this is Wandsworth. The BBC has been given unprecedented access inside a British jail. Over seven days, we saw the fear and violence. Yeah, it's one person under restraint there, the wing looks secure. You've got to be able to defend yourself, innit? If you can't defend yourself, then you'll become a victim, innit? The drugs feeding addiction inside. You can get spice, you can get heroin, you can get crack, you can get anything you like. Anything right now. from Right now. Is it easy to get cannabis? It is, it is, it is, it is, it is, it is. I want my profit! Get down! The prison officers pushed to the very edge. I think I'm probably the most stressed I've been in 24 years in this, in this job. And the governor demanding change. Without reform, I don't know how long we could sustain the prison system. Our prisons are changing. The government is reforming six jails in England and Wales by handing back control over budgets and contracts to their governors. Wandsworth is one of them. We spent six months persuading the Ministry of Justice to allow us inside. This is what we found. Oh, Can you run? Can you run? B-Wing. And Jennifer, a new recruit. And Steve, a Wandsworth veteran, face the first alarm of the day. Run! An inmate is refusing to go back to his cell. Neddy Lee. 20 years ago, he murdered a man in a fight. Get down! This is his 38th jail. He told us he was trapped in a cycle of violence. In the two decades I've been in, I've had warfare in jail. I've got a slice down the side of the face. I don't know cut me. See? It's been non-stop, constant. Violence. I've been violence non-stop. been stabbed through the chest. I've had my arm broke. I've got three broken bones in my hand. I've had murders in here, left, right and centre. And I've, I've gone to them and said, look, at the end of the day, you're putting me in a predicament where I have no alternative but to utilise violence for my safety or to assert position on the wing. And that's totally counterproductive to my progression. I need to go home. I've just said baby. Psychologically, it's torture. Emotionally, it's, it's very, very difficult. And with the greatest respect, they're so short-staffed in here, this place can't run. It's unsafe. Even a lot of the staff that are in here are in fear. We're going down two, we're going to bang up. And facing this pressure, Jennifer. This is her first job inside a prison. Four weeks in? Yeah, four weeks in. You're shaking. Yeah, but it's, you know, it's, it's, it's you know, like the, the rush. You know, something going to happen. Like, I've done so much. That was the first time I've used my CNR, which is use of force. Oh. It all goes off here. Yeah. Job for you? Yeah, definitely. Like, it, it happens on a regular basis. We just have to get used to it. The times inside Wandsworth, it felt relentless. An overcrowded, understaffed Victorian jail. This alarm is because there's been a fight in the yard. So that looks like a chair leg that was thrown down there. At least one officer has been hurt. Are you all, are you all right? We're all leaving. To understand what happened, we asked to watch the CCTV footage. There you go. On the left, you can see one inmate attack another with the chair leg, breaking his arm. In seconds, the fight spreads. We're told this was planned. Two South London gangs fighting over respect. Every day I wake up and I think I've got God with me. So I don't Days know. later, we tracked down the man who started the fight. So it makes me much better. A rare opportunity to ask why. It happens every day. It's like violence. Violence just happens every day. Just if it's maybe from this postcode and that postcode and that. And so the gangs follow you in here? Yeah, the gang, the gang follow you. When you're a gang member, everywhere you go, you, you're known to be a, you're just known to a gang member and that. And when you walked out on that yard? Mm, um, um, yeah, when I walked out, uh, I walked out in the exercise yard, I thought, yeah, I had to fight. I had to fight because if I don't fight in that, I won't be a...